Hello everyone, Moose Torrent here, and today I just wanted to show you guys a build I've been starting to work on. I call it the Blast Pal, utilizing the Lumu Smasher. Now most people, including myself, are just going to see this axe and say, Nope, I'm not using a weapon with a pink heart on it, with some white fur around it, that's, that's stupid. But it's actually a pretty good weapon. And I'm kind of getting used to the heart, but I still don't like it. <laughs> I'm hoping that when I upgrade it to uh, Limo Smasher 2, or maybe 3, the heart goes away? Or changes into, I don't know, a skull or something? <laughs> I doubt it, but... Anyways, let's just turn around so you can't see that. It's actually pretty cool. Let me just go over the stats of the Lumo Smasher. Base damage for the attack is 525, gets an affinity of extra 20%, and I have 120 of the blast unlocked. You actually get 360 total there. It gets one slot, and the file type is power file. So I have some boosters on it. My attack's gonna go to 557, and my element is gonna go to the blast is gonna go to, go to 140. Normally, this weapon would not have any blast damage on it, but I saw that the Zora Claws, which you can make pretty easily, all you have to do is beat Zora Magdaros, and you can get it. It has the free element slash ammo up ability, and that unlocks your weapon's hidden element, but also increases bowgun loading capacity. I'm not really worried about that part. Right now, it's only at level 1. And that draws out 33% of Hidden Element. It also expands the clip, but like I said, I'm not worried about that. So I'm getting the 120. And 120 times 3, obviously 360. So pretty cool there that you can get an extra 120 damage. The Blast works kind of like Bleed does in Dark Souls. You hit people a bunch of times, and then eventually that bar builds up and then they get blasted by an explosion that comes out of nowhere. <laughs> I guess it comes out of the axe somehow. Stored up in the heart maybe? I don't know. But it does a lot of damage and it's really cool. The other parts of the Zora Magros armor I have the uh, headgear, the hide, and the claws. They all have... oops. Um, the Zora Magdaros Mastery, which increases abnormal status effect damage when landing critical hits. And that includes Paralysis, Poison, Sleep, and Blast. So, I don't really know exactly how this works. I'm assuming that if you hit the um, critical hit when you would inflict the uh, status effect, it's going to boost the damage. And normally that really would not be worth it. But, as I said earlier, the affinity on the Lumu Smasher is 20%, so you're going to get criticals 20% more of the time than you normally would. So it could actually be useful with those three. Like I said, the build is still a work in process, but I gotta say that it seems pretty synergistic so far. I like where it's going. Like I And I think I mentioned this earlier, I hope when I upgrade the Lumu Smasher to plus 2 or 3, this heart goes away. And I'll keep working on it, let you guys know if I come up with something better. But right now I'm just going to go ahead and show you a match. Well, not really a match, but I'm going to beat up a monster. So you guys can see the power of the Blast. The Blast Pal is what I've been calling it. And what better way to test the Paolumu weapon other than fighting the Paolumu? So we're going to head to the Coral Highlands and take out the Fuzzy Bat Buddy. Well, that was weird. Whee! Oh, 
she's down there. I'm gonna try to jump on her. Give her the plunging attack. I don't see her anymore though. Oh, she's over here now. Boom! I got it. Did not expect to actually hit her, but oh, he did. Go back to the head and neck. Try to get some extra damage there. Pretty good way to start off things. And there's 93 damage. <laughs> I think that was the blast right there. It's hard to tell. Oh, it's its head is definitely broken. That's not hard to tell. I should have used my uh, boosts before I came down here. Oh well. I got time to do it now, I guess. Sort of. Might seed! <laughs> and there's some more blast, 120. Uh, I hate this stupid ball mode. I'm gonna fucking hit it with the sword in it when it's in ball mode. Alright, I'm going back to axe. I also hate stunning. Nice. Oh, down it goes. Oh, my cat put to sleep. We're doing quite a lot of damage. Oh, some blast to the face. You guys know how much I like saying blast. So it would just make sense that I'm using a blast build. I saw some material on the ground somewhere over here. Did it disappear? Hmm. That's too bad. I'm sure we'll get a ton for killing it though. I've never really tried to cut off the tail. It just seemed like it has so much more defense on the tail that there's like no point in attacking it. I wonder if you get something for it. destroying the tail. <laughs> nice direct hit to the ball. Wow, I can't believe that one missed. That was nowhere near him. He's just going after the cat. He almost got me good there. Must have hit his foot. Have to sharpen soon as well. Yeah, I'm not doing too much damage to the tail. Well, he's no longer in ball mode. Let me just get a quick potion. Oh, there's the blast knocking him over. And it's time for some sword mode.
Oh. <laughs> that was pretty uneventful. Bat rage. I wonder if I have any shock pods. Wow, there's the blast. Ouch. He stunned me. Wow. He's getting a bunch of lucky shots. Uh, let me scroll through here. Flash pod. Just want to make sure I hit him with it. Wow. There we go. Now he's back on the ground. What the heck? I don't even know what happened there. Must have hit a sleep toad or something. Vitality Mantle! Alright, Pink Pat, you're going down! We're hitting him in the butt. <laughs> oh, finally the sword is charged up. <laughs> and 120 blast on the tail. He does not look like he's in good shape. Yeah, he did go to sleep. And we got him. So, <laughs> the axe does a pretty good amount of damage. Like I said, I'm still working on the build. It's definitely not done yet, but I just thought it was an interesting setup to look at. Let me know what you guys think of it. This is Moose Torrent, and I'll be back with another video for you shortly.